for that large heavy duty one. Uh, coming up in just a moment, don't you go anywhere. With the final 500 of these remaining, it is the world's first um, or, or, you know, manual portable washing machine. Less than five gallons of water is all you need. So you have a small apartment, you wanna wash your intimates, you wanna save on electricity, this is the way to go. It's coming up after the break, stay with us. Join me, Brett Chuckerman, for Healthy You tonight at 7 p.m. Take charge of your health and wellness. Our trusted experts provide products, solutions, and tips created to enhance every part of your life tonight at 7 p.m. I think everybody in America raised their hand. Who wants to save on electricity bills? Everybody raised their hand. Who wants to save on water? Look at this item. It's called the laundry pod. We haven't had it back in like, what, like two to three years. This is the first time or one of the first times back this visit. Final 500 left. This is the world's first manual portable washing machine. We're talking about no electricity required. We're talking about being able to do your laundry wherever you are. So if you're in an RV, if you live in a small apartment, if you got to travel down to the basement. When I used to rent, I used to have to go down to the very scary basement of this apartment building to do laundry. We're talking about never having to leave your home again, if you don't want to, to go ahead and wash your clothes. Wrap your brain around that. This is item 570730. If this is something that interests you, even if it's just for your hand washing your garments, uh, please stay with us this presentation. I have less than 600 of these. To tell us all about it is Kelly Diedrich. You know I love this thing. Oh, and I who am doesn't? amazed by this thing, and yes. every time it's here, it sells out. We haven't had yep. it back in quite some time. No, we don't. And let's talk about some of the features of the laundry pod, because you might be thinking, what in the world is this thing? Okay, so it's great for apartments. Anybody that doesn't have a typical washer, the kind you plug in the kind that takes 70 gallons of water it's really great for there less than five gallons for a whole cycle that's insane if you're spending money on big water bills no electricity so absolutely nothing to plug in it's easy to clean but most importantly it's really easy to use okay so you're getting the laundry pod and it's essentially you know about one square foot one square right. cube okay so if you're wondering well will it store under my countertop the handle actually folds down so you're getting the laundry pod inside is the the spinner basket and I'm going to talk all about that you can see right here that's actually what's going to be cleaning your clothing and then you're also going to get a way to drain it and so I'm going to show you all of those yep. features as we go but what I want to show you is what you're going to be using it for so anytime you have a small load of laundry anytime you don't want to go to the laundromat right. and spend all that money or just feel icky at the laundromat mm -hmm. or at the laundromat people are touching our clothes and getting them out of their way have you ever yeah. had that happen or maybe you just don't like hand washing I know a lot of folks that use this in replacement of any kind of hand washing because right. this is basically hand washing 2.0. You don't have to wring anything out, anybody with any kind of dexterity issues. Or ladies, what I'm gonna do today is your delicates. Nine pieces of delicates fit in here. So that was a nighty. I'm talking several bra and panty sets. Leslie, do you know how much you spend on a bra? <laughs> I sure do. Okay, so I spent about 50 to $60 and that's a good sale. Right? On a bra, on a one bra. Yeah. In no way you wanna throw that in your regular washing machine destroys. after you spend so much money your clothing. So anything that's a delicate, that's hand wash only, you can now put in the laundry pot. You're also going to save money on detergent because you need about one tenth of the detergent. Literally just a little dribble of a your drop. traditional. Yeah. And if you do like Nellie's, you need like a third of a scoop of the Nellie's. Right. So you're going to save money there. And then most importantly, you're going to save money on your water bill. Okay. A traditional wash takes 50 to 60 gallons of water. I did not know that, but it makes sense, right? So if you're doing three or four washes a week, you're, you're paying for hundreds, unless you're on a well, but you know, most of us aren't 
200 gallons of water that you're paying in that water bill. Oh and that's gosh. why when you get that water bill home, you're shocked. You're yeah. like, do we really do that much laundry? And then what do you do? You load up the laundry to do let, you know, and then it doesn't get as clean because right. you're putting too many clothes in it. For your in-between loads, for your delicates, all you do is put one to two gallons of water depending how, on how full. That was nine pieces of clothing, but maybe if you have a couple of scrub tops or a couple of uniform shirts, you know, that might be two or three, four right. pieces. It locks into place and then watch this. This one's clear. Your, yours, when you get at home, will be white, but ours is clear here to show you what's happening on the inside, Leslie. It is literally turning into a washing machine. Do you see the suds? And I'm not giving this any elbow grease. I'm just right. spinning, you know, it doesn't take any sort of... Right, like if you were wringing the water out of your salad, right? Absolutely. Like those salad spinners, like yeah. Like a salad spinner, that's exactly right. Now, it's for righties and lefties because it goes both ways, so I can use either hand. Remember that handle folds down for easy storing. But as I spin this one time, the basket spins four to six times. Right. So, I mean, you don't have to spin it fast because yeah, the you basket... Can tell. You could tell it's going faster than yeah, what you're doing. Yeah, so then yeah. let me just show you what's happening. Have you ever opened up your washer mid-cycle? Yeah. It looks exactly like that. Right. That's exactly what's happening, except now I haven't plugged anything too, in. Yeah. yeah, I mean, it's really agitating it. It's really cleaning your clothes. But I haven't plugged anything in, and I've literally used one gallon means of I water. I could do laundry wherever. Wherever I, you want. Right, where, where I could literally buy a bottle of water yep. at the corner store or at the gas station oh. and do my laundry. Uh, this is the world's first uh, manual portable washing machine. So if you're sick and tired of traveling to do laundry, yep. if you're sick and tired of wasting so much money on electricity, on your water bills, if you're a person that travels, are you a trucker? Yep. Do you live in an RV, RV. or a trailer? Yep. Uh, do you have a kid that's off to college and you want to keep them safe? Maybe they can do their own laundry out right in their dorm room. Yeah. This is such a great solution. And there are so many of you that live alone that don't really have giant loads of laundry to do anyway. So many this people so are doing are running their full load and they're not doing a whole lot of clothing. Right. I love that you say keeping your college students safe in a dorm room. Who wants to send their young daughter or son off to uh, a dark you know, laundry room, a, a dark laundry uh, mat, yeah. or you know, more importantly, how much money do they spend at the laundromat? And when I was in uh, college, I had to go down 30 flights of stairs or the elevator to the dark basement. I had to have a whole bunch of quarters. If I didn't have enough quarters, I had to go find quarters. People were constantly touching my clothes and getting them out of their way to put yeah. their clothes in. It's not a convenient way to do your clothing. So this is our rinse cycle. So if you think of a traditional washer, you do a wash, you do a rinse, and you do a spin. Sure. This machine does all three. So a I wash, saw, a rinse, and a spin. I saw that you emptied out, yep. right? So uh, there's a little hose on right. the back, and I'll and, show it and, to you on this and unit. And by the way, we literally have a bucket. Yep. So that's that's all <laughs> yeah. you do, and I just spilled all that water. That's okay, okay. don't worry. We've, we're working with water. We've got water. Yeah. Um, so all you do is pop that lid back in place. So this is your rinse. So um, if you have, um, and of course my... Um, my drain was open, guys, so I'm going to pour that water back in. Sorry. Um, so you just want to take clean water, but that's a great place to show you the hose, okay? Right. So the hose comes out, and your water goes in. When you want to drain it, you just switch that nozzle. I've just closed it again. So this is my rinse cycle. So once you've washed your clothes, and it takes about a minute, if you're wondering, mm -hmm. about a minute to two minutes of, you know, constant motion will clean your clothes just like a traditional washing machine. Yeah, or if you, hey, look, if you want to sit there for half hour turning oh, your clothes. Oh, sure. But that's the beauty. Like, That's you know, the with your standard it. washing machine, the washing machine's in control. Yep. It tells you, you know, you have to select what and cycle you want. You destroys have destroys your clothes. Right. I mean, I've got, got a, this. I've got a washing machine that has the clear lid, and right. I watch it. It it really does a number on your clothes, yeah. right? It's shaking them all around. If you have anything that's delicate or anything with maybe like some embellishments, like little rhinestones, you want to do it here, and no more do you have to hand wash. Now that was my rinse cycle. My rinse, I do about one minute. Okay. Right. So one to two minutes on the wash about one minute minimum on yeah. your on your rinse and then this is to me the craziest part so once I drain it and you can see that hose comes right out the side there and then there's a little tab that opens it I'm gonna flip it around for you guys so you can see it there it is yep there it is and then all you do is switch it to open and you're gonna watch the water now if you're at home or if you're in an apartment you can drain this into a utility sink, a into tub. your bathtub. Yep. But if you're outdoors and you're camping or hiking, or we have a lot of people that own these in their RVs or truckers, right. and you're using, say, Nellie's or an environmentally friendly laundry detergent, you can drain it anywhere. Right. I mean, you could drain it into the flower bed. Sure, yeah, sure. So. And so here's the thing. This is the only planned airing of the day. I haven't presented this with Kelly in more than two years. Yeah. So it's hard to get it back. And when it sells out, it's sold out until we can do that. I have the final 500 
hundred of these to go around. Uh, it sells out every time. It's such a smart solution. People buy it, heaven forbid, just in case there's a power outage. Oh, it's actually great you know? for that. We get a lot of people hey, that have it? one to two weeks without power. You know, you just want it. You, you just want have it. to yeah. have it. And so it's such a yes. Could I hand wash my stuff? Of course I can hand wash my yep. stuff. But you're never going to do the job that this is going to do because this really works just like a washing machine, except it's the world's first manual, portable, take with you wherever you want washing machine. And it's this the is only plan airing. The flex pay is just for today. So that 1992 expires or 1999 flex pay expires at midnight. $20 off. We're going to save you money, save electricity, save water, yes. save detergent. Yes. It's so smart. And also time. But let's just show you. This is actually the spin cycle. So that's what we were talking about. Your traditional washer does a wash, a rinse, and a spin. This does a wash, a rinse, and a spin, just like a traditional washer. But what's so cool about this is now I can actually spin all the last drops and driplets out of my clothes. You can see the last remaining drops and drips that were in my delicates are now coming out. And that means for me, if I am hand washing, I have no more wringing. Have you ever hand washed your delicates, ladies? Or maybe it's a nice blouse or a top and you're sitting there wringing and wringing well, and by the end, you don't, you don't your even hands want hurt. to ring. Well, you don't sometimes even want to. Sometimes you ruin to. things by wringing them. My uh, babysitter pointed out that I ring wrong. Really? <laughs> She's like, you ring wrong. Oh, wow. She, she's like, that's not the way you ring. And I didn't like, know there really? was a, a, a wrong yeah, or a well, right to it. I mean, well, these... maybe you ring wrong. Yeah, now you can I actually, <laughs> this, I mean, you feel that. Doesn't that feel yeah. as if it came out of your yeah. spin cycle Completely. on your washing machine? Completely. Because you've now spun it dry. So we talk to a lot of folks that get this just, even if they still want to hand wash something, just to spin it dry. Because it will spin all the last drips and drops out. And then if you want to put this in your traditional dryer, feel free. But if it's something like your delicates, Go ahead and just leave it out on the line and dry yeah. it naturally. That's what I like to do too. Yes. Here's the thing, everybody. I've got about 400 and change of these. This will sell out again. It sells out every single time. You can bring this home for $19 and change on any debit or credit card. Flex pays for everybody. I say that it's good to have just heaven forbid if there's a power outage. Yep. You know, you, this is good to have if you're sick and tired of going elsewhere to do laundry. If you're sick and tired of that water bill, that electricity bill, and you're just looking for ways to save money every month. This is the smartest way to do it. Now, am I going to be able to do 50 pieces of laundry in here? No. This is of for the smaller not. in between this loads. This is for yep. smaller in between loads or the pieces you want to hand wash, yep. the pieces delicates. that are delicates. You yep. know, this is not going to have that giant capacity of a washing machine, but many people don't need that giant capacity, especially if you live in a trailer or an RV, especially if you're a trucker, especially if you're a college student. This might be all you need. Imagine how much money now you're putting back in your wallet, back in your pocketbook. Oh, and also think of the time. So my fast cycle is 35 minutes. That just take, took me about four minutes. Yeah. So 35 minutes versus four minutes. One to two gallons total versus 60 gallons that I'm paying for. Also, these are just some examples. You use Great. it however you want to use it, okay? But baby clothes. Maybe this is a gift for a new mom that you know they're not going to put baby clothes idea. with spit up all over them in a traditional washer, right? right. You want to wash those all together. Great for baby clothes because those are nice small in-between loads. We talk to a lot of nurses, you know, um, veterinarians, dental hygienists, dentists that wear the same pair of scrubs every day and they don't want to own 20, you know, different pairs of scrubs. So they have to wash them nightly or every other night. You know what? And they what, throw about, their... what about fitness clothes and karate geese? Exactly. Right? People that you sweat. from experience? <laughs> I'm talking from experience. Like people yes. that sweat and they only have one gi and they yes, want to just go that's ahead. That's actually yeah. really great. Mm -hmm. So that's why we have, for me, it's the yoga pants. I've got probably about 30, but I like like two of them. Yeah. So I want my favorite <laughs> yoga pants the next day. I've got to throw them. Um, campers, hikers, anybody that's off the grid for a week or two weeks. RVers, um, yeah. trailers, uh, you know, mobile homes. Sorry, Leslie, I'm yeah. standing right in That's front of you. Okay. And then anybody that has like a cottage or a vacation home, the family of swimwear. You never should put your swimwear in a traditional washer. It destroys it. it. It's so genius for so many reasons. But I think, you know, we had so many storms last year. We had, you know, people now, currently, right now, here in Florida, the weather's beautiful. But currently, right now, in the Northeast, yep. in the Midwest, people still dealing with power outages and terrible weather. Yep. If you lose power for a week here, I lost power for three days during yes. the hurricane, and it's amazing. We're just you not used to it anymore. Underwear, like I would have had clean baby clothes, <laughs> clean underwear. So think about this as something that really, if you can swing it, it's just $19.99 on a flex pay to get home. You pay over time. Mm -hmm. uh, it's on a price break. If you can swing it, this is something I really Try think it. is a great idea everybody should have. You're saving money, saving electricity, yep. saving detergent. What's not to love? Yeah, Final and I know, 390 by I the way. Know a lot of
lot of folks that are just very, very environmentally conscientious. And yeah. so maybe they still use their traditional washer dryer once or twice a week or once or twice a month, depending on how often you want to use this. This is no electricity. You can see I did one gallon of water. I did my favorite detergent, just a little drip of detergent. If you're using like an environmentally friendly detergent, feel free to drain this water anywhere. Mm -hmm. Now what's so cool is it literally turns into a washing machine. Look at the inside of this unit. If you've ever opened your washing machine mid-cycle or you have the clear lid ones, which I do, I see what's happening. It's the exact same situation. It's mm -hmm. agitating my clothes. It's, get, you know, drumming up those suds. Everything's getting all nice and washed. That's exactly what's happening here. Now, this, you're doing it yourself. Yeah, this yeah. is clear, guys. When you get this home, it's, yours will be white. But no, this is just to thing. show you what's happening. Think about it. And if you do spend a lot of money on your expensive bras, think of this as like maybe two bras, one oh, bra. Yeah. If you save I mean, one this, bra. If you save one bra, <laughs> you this is a this. price break of $79.95. If you save one bra or one very expensive piece of clothing or, or on your dry cleaning yeah. bills, you've made your money back. That's I have true. the final 370 of these. We will sell out of this again. And remember, the last time we had this here it was about in one show. And it was like